Hello and welcome to this Prospect 365 CRM video where we'll be looking at reserving stock for pre-season estimates. Reserving stock for pre-season estimates can be helpful if you are running a business where you have seasonal stock. You may need to contact all of your best customers at the start of the season and ask them how many of this new line of products they are likely to sell, providing you with their pre-season orders. These pre-season orders may require you to reserve a particular quantity of products each month. For example, 10 times 1.5 AA batteries in February and 20 in March. The customer hasn't ordered these products and don't want you to automatically send them, but they have made a broad commitment to ordering these items. Therefore, your sales team may need to contact these customers each month to see if they would like their pre-season order. If this customer is likely to place the order, then you may want to ensure the stock is available for their pre-season order. To help manage stock levels with pre-season orders, the CRM provides stock levels taking into account the pre-season estimates. On the screen here, we have the 1.5 AA battery product, which currently has an available from stock level of 34 and an available with pre-season stock level of 30. In order to set pre-season estimates for your customers, you will need to create a quote and add the required products. For this example, I would just open up one of our recent quotes, which already has the product 1.5 AA battery with a quantity of four. We can also see that the current reserve stock is set to not reserved. To set this order to a pre-season estimate, simply click on this drop down and select the pre-season estimate option. Now, if we navigate back to our 1.5 AA battery product and refresh this available stock, we'll then see that the available with pre-season stock level has gone down to 26. The available from stock level over here currently hasn't changed. This is because the pre-season estimates are not an actual order yet. So being able to see these two stock level figures will help your sales team manage expectations for actual orders and pre-season orders.